All right, we've done uh, lengthening and using timing to go down down the arena wall. Now we're going to use uh, the next piece of this is going to make some circles, making sure that we have uh, that good timing in uh, with Dylan um, in our circles. All right, so let's get this started. Again, we're going to be using spots one and two, lengthening just this side of the leg, this left side, since I'm on the left side of the horse. All right, and using our, our reins to shorten the left leg, not worrying at all about the inside or the outside leg. All right, so this is the inside of the horse, inside of the arena, outside of the horse, outside of the arena. Okay, so if I refer to inside, outside, you guys will know what I'm talking about. All right, so spot one right there. Say, Dylan, let's go forward. I have to go up on our training scale a little bit there to just wake him back up. All right, we're back here with Dylan now, uh, under saddle, and we've worked to uh, consolidate the rhythm in hand with Dylan. And again, rhythm is timing, uh, balance, impulsion, and speed control. Okay, so we're gonna do some exercises with Dylan under saddle, and um, we're gonna work on those, those, those four things. Now I'm gonna call this arena exercise one. All right, now this is basically, you're gonna walk, you're gonna stop, you're gonna back, and then you're gonna walk again. So just a real simple thing we're gonna do real quick. Now through this entire process, we're gonna be lengthening and shortening the horse's stride. Okay, we're gonna use our, our spots one and two, again, to deal with and work on getting the horse to lengthen and then shorten our strides. Uh, shorten the stride comes from the reins. Remember, we're gonna ask the horse to shorten as we walk. All right, and to lengthen the stride, we're gonna say, first use spot one, take a step forward, go forward for me. Spot two is going to say, now take a bigger step for me. And we're going to do that with timing. All right, we've done arena exercises one, two, three, and now we're on arena exercise four. All right, arena exercise four is basically a rectangle. Now we're gonna do lengthening and shortening throughout this uh, rectangle. And I'm gonna be doing some circles and some stopping and some going throughout that. Now I'm gonna do it at the walk and I'm also do it at the trot. Now once you get really good at rhythm, you can take this exercise and lengthen it out, spread it out a little bit more and you can actually do it uh, at the lope. But you have to go through line and, and get into connection before we can start doing that. So remember again, rhythm is timing, rhythm is a balance, rhythm is impulsion, rhythm is a speed control. These are the things we're looking for from the horse to give us. Now through all that we're also looking for our basic controls. Go, stop, left, right, uh, back up and stand still, and relaxation, flexion, and strength. Okay, All those things have to come into play to do these exercises, um, to do them correctly. We're going to do them five to seven times correctly, and then we're going to swap sides uh, from left to right or whatever which way we uh, decide to start.